we were walking across the Justin Road, we was walking along the road and a car crashed into a pole. And like a couple of kids got out of the car that looked about 17, 16, something like that, and like set light to the car straight after they crashed it. Threatened to come up and kick it in and break windows and things. And so I walked from, walked from my lawn to the, to the side of the road and said, you know, it's not a good idea, mate, it's, it's not yours. The key impacts on safety in the community are probably around uh, dangerous use of motorbikes and cars. I'm reserved into what I let my kids do on the streets, going to the park, um, playing out the front because you are worried. I can see that people are ready for change and that they are ready to stand together as one. In the community, by and large, is already very positive around, around seeing change, improving safety, and I think that there's a sense that people are almost going to get left behind. I think the shift now is there's a greater focus on the community itself saying, no, we're going to look at the issue from the inside out and actually work on it ourselves. To improve the safety in community should start like helping each other out and help maybe help the community as well. Say hello to the person you pass in the street. I think to, to build stronger communities you need to have connection. Then you can make a decision to intervene rather than what a lot of people do now and that is make a decision not to intervene so nothing changes. I guess I felt pretty good the fact that I'd helped change his mind about the idea of damaging a property that wasn't his. Like there's wonderful people that work in the community here the friends that I have, the fact that, you know, it's not just a friendship, it's like a community family. It's changed more than it used to be. It used to be twice as bad as it used to be. And I think for Clarence Plains, their aspirations for public safety are exactly the same as adults all around Tasmania and around Australia. They want a safe place to raise their children. I think it's really worth putting the time and effort into improving safety. It is a strong community, it's made up of great people and it, it just really is worth it, it's worth putting the effort into.